So we are making a chicken kebab and cauliflower called gobi manchuri and papadam and veg pala and chapati and what else? Butter chicken and vegetable curry. We've been here since 7 a.m. very early and it is 4.45 now and we still have two hours to go. It's been really cool being able to cook for people and seeing people's faces when they walk in the door, smelling all the amazing smells and being so happy to take away a free meal. I really enjoy cooking and I enjoy being a servant, so combining those two together is really nice. It's been hot. It's been really hot. Um, this is not my first time cooking Indian food or cooking a lot of food like this. Um, I'm quite used to it actually, but it is not something I've done in a while, so it is really good to kind of get back to that part of community and connection. Um, and I think, yeah, just making food for people is a really good way to love. I think a lot of people describe their love language as food. It reminds me a lot of how Jesus led his life, of just giving people food, giving people what they need, and being with them. Um, of course, it's COVID, so we can't really hang out with people yet, but it's been cool to meet them. Um, I'm learning a lot from James. He is an amazing chef, so learning more from his cooking is amazing as well. Just enjoy cooking in more cultures. Um, so it's been great. It's very interesting. I really love these people. They, they, they are here from, uh, you know, uh, early five minutes before to seven. So still that they are helping me. They are really enjoying and eating and talking and laughing. You know, it's really joy to cook together with the uh, DTS Outreach team. And apart from that, we are really enjoying to bless others. You guys know that we used to do open houses, um, but due to the COVID situation, we have to think about a new strategy, and we asked God about it, and God gave us this idea of takeaway with the Indian meal. We started to do this last year, July, and then we had a big, huge gap in between, and now we started to do it again from February for every month, but we give like a different time slot so people can come um, to follow the government restrictions, social distancing. And now we used to get more new people uh, getting to know about this takeaway food ministry from their friends. So this month I really got new people whom I have never met so far. It's exciting. Thank you God.